first few days of preseason have gone pretty well. Um, coach being on the ice, guys are working hard. Physicality's good, motion's there. So it's all positives that we want going into the season. Well, the vibe this year going in, uh, especially move-in day in preseason, especially as soon as captain's case started, the vibe, everybody started to click right away, even with the freshmen, made them feel welcome off the bat. So we constantly had like right away that family kind of vibe. So definitely a good feeling going into this year. Um, our energy has been great, actually. Our captains did a great job preseason. You know, preseason coaches aren't around, um, and so it lays on the captains a little bit for them to get our guys in shape and did a tremendous job. I think uh, this year speed is a big asset of ours, so uh, playing with the pace that we want to play with and uh, you know, having other teams in their zone is, is what we want to do. I mean, we've been working on a lot, is, uh, like you heard from the other three uh, captains, is uh, high tempo. Um, being in everybody's face, not sitting back, constantly going north, um, and just competing 24-7, playing full 60. You can't play 58 minutes to win a hockey game. You need to play full 60. No, we got a good core of guys. Um, with the freshmen coming in, we got some good talent. Um, we're going to be young in the back end, so we'll have to work on that. Uh, but up front, we're very offensively talented. We got a lot of speed, um, so that's going to be one of our strengths. Yeah, uh, Hobart's always an opponent that we look, look forward to playing. Um, you know, they're always high ranked. Uh, it'll be a good test for us. And yeah, like you said, uh, there is a buzz around campus and expect to have a good turnout. So we want to put on a good show too. I would say the biggest thing when playing Hobart um, with Elmira, it's a historical rivalry and it's going to be a physical competition. It's going to be a very close game. It's going to be one that you're going to want to see. We need all 27 guys to buy in every day. It doesn't matter where you are in the lineup, where you are in practice. Everybody needs to buy in and come together as a family. We saw it the past three years, what happened, it's not acceptable. We need to get back to what Elmira College is. You know, opening up against uh, two ranked teams in the top 10, I wouldn't want it any other way. Um, it'll be a good test for us to see what we got right off the bat. You know, to get Volt in the national spotlight after having three conference wins is a little, I, I guess maybe it's a credit to the history of our program, but it was a little bit surprising to me, honestly. Um, you know, I know how good our group is. I know what we have in our locker room. And I really think we're going to shock a lot of people this year.